Hi friends, uh, my name is Ratan. So in this video, we will discuss in collection framework. What is the last video? The last video is the, the last video discussed about vector. In the vector add 1 to 30 elements. So print even values, remove odd values. Just we are removing odd values, right? That's all. In this video, regarding vector only, take the vector. Can you please create a product class, product object? Okay, can you please create what? Product object. Take the product object product id product name product cast product contains so many values here total three values i'm talking about the product class here the product the product contains so many values here. product id hmm. product name last one is what product cast total three of three values are there so you can please create a product class contains id name and cast during object creation i want initialize the values then declare the constructor convert the values right you know that process already then take the product class then take the vector then take the vector in the vector uh, can please add three product objects add uh, three product objects simply add uh, three product objects okay so add the three product objects into the vector simply and the vector how many cursors are applied see you know we are reading the data by using for each loop and we are reading the data by using get method and we are reading the data by using cursors and later you use the for each method lambda expressions method reference we'll discuss later that point sir okay so what is the on the vector how, now we are talking about the cursors and the vector how many cursors are applied total three cursors enumeration is applied because enumeration only for legacy classes vector is also legacy class right it is applied the second one is what iterator is applied because iterator for all classes a vector is also one of the class right list iterator applied because list iterator only for list classes right vector is also list class so finally on the vector total how many cursors are applied total three cursors okay so read the data by using all cursors read the data by using what all cursors right simply read the data here read the data by using all cursors just uh, by using by using all cursors right that's all so only three just to create the product uh, id name and cast constructor convert the values vector add three objects print the data by using all cursors okay but uh, write the example you'll get some clarity right the previous example we done individually so three examples we are doing now i am saying in a single example write all the data if the requirement is clear just pause the video just pause the video try to complete this example first try to complete the example after completion of the example start the video i think uh, don't feel bored here yeah? okay patience is important while learning the programming languages patience is very very important okay so if you know ratan sir i know everything don't think like that just uh, just pause the video try to do this example here. then start the video now we'll do the practicals then clear so check the practicals The previously we done the video class number 20 now we'll do the video class number 21 video class number 21 you know the requirement right product class object okay think about the product object product id required name required cost required then take the vector class add the data anyway we'll do the practicals by using eclipse id let me open eclipse id this is the previous example right my vector printing the even elements removing the odd elements this is a previous example now this example just to go to the vector click on new go to the package right i created package vector example package in the package just to go to the new i want to create the class what the class name here 
और एक क्लास में टेस्ट टू थ्री क्लासेस जो क्लिक ऑन मेन मेथड क्लिक ऑन फिनिश दैट्स ऑल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हाउ टू क्रिएट द प्रोडक्ट क्लास राइट ओके लेट मी क्रिएट द प्रोडक्ट क्लास देन गो टू द पैकेज जस्ट राइट क्लिक हियर न्यू आई वॉन्ट अ क्लास वॉट अ क्लास नेम यर हियर प्रोडक्ट इज द क्लास ओके जस्ट टू क्लिक ऑन फिनिश द प्रोडक्ट क्लास कंटे सो मेनी आर्ग्यूमेंट आई मेनी वेरिएबल्स है थ्री वेरिएबल्स वन इज द प्रोडक्ट आई डी ओके वन इज द प्रोडक्ट आई डी राइट इंट इंट आई डी इज द नेक्स्ट वन इज वॉट स्ट्रिंग नेम प्रोडक्ट नेम लास्ट वन इज वॉट प्रोडक्ट कास्ट राइट प्रोडक्ट कास्ट इज इंटीजर कॉस्ट दैट्स ऑल देन ड्यूरिंग ऑब इफ यू वॉन्ट मैक्सिमाइज दिस इज मैक्सिमाइज द स्क्रीन डबल क्लिक हियर सिंपली मैक्सिमाइज राइट दैट्स ऑल इफ यू वॉन्ट आई ड्यूरिंग ऑब दर क्रिएशन आई वॉन्ट इनिशलाइज द वैल्यूज ड्यूरिंग ऑब दर क्रिएशन विच पार्ट विल बी एक्सिक्यूटेड कंस्ट्रक्टर पार्ट राइट लेट मी जनरेट द कंस्ट्रक्टर हियर डोंट राइट द कंस्ट्रक्टर जनरेट द कंस्ट्रक्टर राइट क्लिक हियर सोर्स जनरेट कंस्ट्रक्टर यूजिंग फील्ड्स ओके जस्ट क्लिक ऑन ओके थ्री फील्ड्स कंस्ट्रक्टर जनरेटेड राइट दैट्स ऑल क्लियर थ्री फील्ड्स कंस्ट्रक्टर जनरेटेड आर नॉट क्लियर राइट गुड सो नाउ टेक द टेस्ट थ्री क्लास हियर गो द वेक्टर क्लास वट द वेक्टर द वेक्टर वट द जेनरिक ऑब्जेक्ट हियर प्रोडक्ट इज अ जेनरिक राइट simply can write the products product is equal to what new vector of here we have to take the product class right we have to take what the product class or not that's it what i said can please add some products right simply can write the products dot add products dot add of new product new product of don't write the complete data control use the control space better new product i am writing new control space what it is asking product right enter button it is showing everything uh, product id triple one product name what is the product name here the pen is the product name cost will be the uh, 100 rupees 20 rupees otherwise right like that can please add the three products triple one triple two triple three product id pen uh, next one is what uh? <sighs> tell me some products sir pen product is there next one is what fan hmm next one is what light so pen, fan cost is what let me make the 300 rupees light cost is 200 rupees like three products i'm adding right that's all i'm adding three products <coughs> what is the requirement print the data by using three cursors right what is the first cursor tell me here enumeration cursor okay print the data by using enumeration cursor print the data using hmm using enumeration right tell me the code here yeah? how to get the enumeration object by using elements method okay the products dot the method name is called what products dot the method name is called what elements method then what it returns which object uh, enumeration object right enumeration object that's it enumeration of i'm using only generic question here in this example enumeration of which one here product right enumeration of product that's it then before reading we have to check data is available or not available while e dot hmm e dot has more elements if data is available returns true then read the data how to read the data e dot next element what it it will read which data product data right simply can write the product product p right that's it product p then take the while loop here oh, sorry product p ready once the product object is ready you can print the data right then sys out control space p dot uh, id next one is what some space if you have p dot name plus some space plus p dot cost that's it this is the printing the data by using which cursor here enumeration cursor simply run this code how to run this code just right click here run as job application triple one triple two triple three we clear huh? that's all guys next one is what printed the data by using by using which cursor here iterator okay by using iterator then how to get the iterator object the products dot we have to read the iterator object iterator method right iterator method then iterator switch object here iterator object or not iterator iterator of generic question you have to make product which one here product right that's it iterator idr 
then to check data is available or not available to check data is available or not available then take the while loop right while of take the itr dot has next has next returns true means data is available then read the data itr dot the method name is called next method itr dot which method are next right that's it returns which object obviously product object right the product p that's it then print the data so previously i'm using p variable right that p is a local to while loop right local to while loop this p is a local to while loop local to while loop don't think returns are here p is there here p is there any conflicts because inside the loop means that is local right the scope of the local variable is what within the loop only right there's no issue we clear huh? that's all guys so if you want to remove the data how to remove the data tell me i want to remove the triple one product then how to remove the data tell me just you can check the if condition right if hmm, if if product dot pid sorry product dot id right product dot id double <coughs> double equal to triple one then idea dot which method remove right that's it then which product is removed eh? then iterator which triple one product remove right good anyway three values are printing now we are printing three right after printing the data we are removing the data otherwise why unnecessary confusions remove this not required remove operations we done already right we know how to remove the data and all why unnecessary confusions just you can print the data that's it okay the last one is what print the data by using by using what list iterator cursor right that's all how to get list iterator object here simply products dot the method name is called which method list iterator method list iterator method then read switch object here it returns which object list iterator object or not which object uh, list iterator object right that's all generic question is obviously product generic question is a product p right <coughs> list rate rate reference variable you can make a list here then you want to read the data right to read the data one elements are multiple elements multiple elements while of lstr data hmm, lstr data has next to check data is available or not then lstr data the next method right to read the data then what it reads the data it reads the product object right simply can go with the product object product p right that's all as you will print the data p dot id p dot name and p dot cast that's it now we are reading the data by using all three cursors right print the data using enumeration print the data using iterator print the data using list iterator that's it hmm? any questions we have import all the three cursors right it will package run this code if you want right click uh, run as java application triple one triple two triple three triple one triple two triple three triple one triple two triple three right otherwise directly your run button is there click on run button that's all guys i hope you'll get some clarity regarding all the three cursors right how to use and how to work with all the cursors hmm? that's all about the realistic class is completed and uh, vector class is completed what the difference you know right synchronized and non-synchronized we clear up huh? that's all guys so with that your vector class is completed with all cursors also completed with array list is also complete right that's all but just to pause the video try to take the example uh, try to take the examples so thank you guys thanks for watching and like the video and comment the video subscribe to our channel to get the more updates thank you guys bye